Face police groups are calling tonight on police chief Ramon Batista to resign. Union leaders are not mincing words, saying the chief's time in office has amounted to a quote reign of terror. As Joe Dana explains, they have results of a new study to back up their demands. If you look at those who participated in the survey, the results are overwhelming. Nearly half of the Mesa Police Department's employees, 564 of them, or 95% surveyed, said they have no confidence in Chief Batista. Just 23 of those surveyed, 4%, say they support the chief. He is no longer welcome in the Mesa Police Department. He is no longer welcome in our home, and we would like him to leave. The rhetoric getting more vicious against Mesa's top cop. Mesa Police Association President Nate Gavert says it's not personal that he once respected the chief. We got along very well with him for a year. We even joked about at some point we're going to butt heads. But now they've more than just butted heads. Officers accusing Chief Batista of refusing to listen to his own experts and retaliating against employees. They say it all started with two high profile use of force incidents last year when the chief made comments like these. I'm angry, deeply disappointed by what I saw in those videos. We will fix this. The officers involved were later cleared of any crime or major policy violations, though several spent months at home and were then taken off the streets. Chief Bautista still refuses to meet with them face to face and explain his actions. Historically, the department's chiefs have battled negative publicity for another reason going too far in defense of their officers, including a 2013 incident that got national attention on a late night show. And in Mesa, Arizona. When then Chief Frank Milstead told officers in a department video they should get rid of personnel files involving bad behavior if the issues had been resolved. Make sure that um, there's th the things that you don't want in there aren't in there. That seems wrong. Gavert pushes back against the notion that Batista is attempting to restore transparency and accountability saying the department generates more internal investigations per officer than the average. We're not standing up here saying, hey, stop investigating us and stop disciplining us. We're saying do it the right way. Batista is showing no signs of leaving, issuing a statement that reads in part, together we have experienced tremendous growth and face challenges that in the end will make us better. We will continue to build stronger relationships within the department. The union is asking Mesa's council and mayor to publicly force the chief out. So far, the council has backed Chief Batista. Joe Dana, 12 News.